Alrighty, hello, hello, hello. How is everyone doing on this Monday night? Of course, you know what that means. It's Monday night. We're doing some more Mutant Year Zero. I hope everyone's doing well. I am very excited for tonight um, as we are getting close to the end of the game, I believe. We don't have too many more areas left to explore. And that's good enough for me. I'm very excited to see what lays at the end of this trail, how all of our pieces come together. Very excited to see this. And let's hope that the game doesn't crash so much so many times this time. That would be pretty cool. All right. So last time we left off, we found Hammond. We got a whole bunch of new equipment, new gear, very exciting stuff. And now we're heading up to the Horned Devil's Lair, or the Horned Lair. And we're going to check out uh, what is up there before we head down to what I think could be the last area of the game. So we could be ending it tonight, um, which is both fun a little sad because I've enjoyed our time with Mutant Year Zero. Um, but let's go ahead and dive on in and see what we have in store. All right. I hope. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So we are in the lair of the Horned Devil, like I was saying. And we've unlocked everything. So we got to go to Castle Light. So it looks like we have two more areas to explore um, before we call this game finished. All right. Now we've not been here into the lair of the horned devil before. So we don't know what this is going to be like. I'm going to go ahead and heal ducks up to max. And if I remember correctly, I'm waiting on a mutagen. Um, because having his eagle eye perk for what I'm running him as is just too darn good. Um, and I, I think I might actually be holding out for the permanent health boost, um, simply because his high ground with an 85% chance to crit with him just being up, this just is amazingly powerful for ducks. So I think, I think we're good with leaving ducks as is. All right. Um, so we've got... Boar man here. We're gonna have boar man in the lead Let's take a look over here and see what we have Over to this side of the world Okay. All right looks like we've got some supplies over here some scrap some broken gun Some electric parts. That's pretty cool and a med pack cool so we got back that med pack that we just used on ducks so we're sitting pretty back at four oh stuck on a piece of terrain there okay let's see here what else we got oh oh we've got uh there we go okay So we've got a Marauder. You spot anything? Nothing. No one comes. No one. All right. Mermaid Z600 Manual, page 319, section 3B, Combatant Familiarization System, FCFS. Friendly fire. Friendly. Fire is now a non-issue with the Miramir's updated combat familiarization system algorithm. The Z600 can now be set to recognize allies by uploading biometric data. The high-speed laser scanning system is 99.9 .9 accurate. Ooh, I'd hate to be that 0.1%. Setup important to set up ally recognition. Before boot up, insert correctly formatted CFS drive A into drive slot B. Attention, if the drive order is set to reverse, the C600 will engage all with impunity. And if this occurs, do not boot. Yeah, be strong. We got metal giant. 
what wonders shall be revealed. I wonder if that is a hint to us as the player. Oh, okay. Oh. All right. Can I? All right. So I think what the big thing is. Okay. Let's see. Twenty-four damage. Big thing I want to do is get rid of that shaman, right? Let's activate. Take over the Marauder. Oh, there's an artifact over there. Okay, cool. Okay. I'm gonna activate Boar Man. We're gonna activate his running gun. Heck yeah. And run over here. We're gonna fire our weapon. Okay. He's got 10 health. Oh, and it will be base. Okay. Well, there's something. Oh, there's a bunch of people. Okay. We move over here with ducks. <laughs> nice one. Yeah, okay. And then we just elevate up. Oh, he has a hundred percent crit chance. Nice. And he's dead. Yeah. Good stuff. And that's why we give ducks wings, baby. Let's regroup. Get some weapon parts here. Oh man, the shaman didn't drop anything. That's some baloney. Um, what you doing? Oh, you're also stuck on the camping gear. Okay. So it looks like we're getting a little further in over there. I saw a red line and I see a red dot over here to this side. So what's over here? Oh, investigate. Campus. that murdered his settlement came here. The lair of the horned devil. Okay. So this sign clearly indicates there's a devil with horns in there, plus a bunch of ghouls who butcher settlements for fun. Who wants to turn around? Let's vote. The horny devil can blow me. These ghouls just messed with the wrong goddamn stalkers. We can't let them slaughter another settlement. This ends right here, right now. Hell yeah, boy, man. Hell yeah. All right. So now the layer of the Horned Devil becomes a little more apparent because... Ooh, what is this? I've seen these machines before, but never this well preserved. Must have fallen recently. And that star... A dead ghoul. wonder what mangled him so badly. Hmm... I wonder if we're going to run into a moose. So I know there is one expansion out for this. And you get a moose. Anyway, Extreme Survival Weekends. Ooh. Camp Moose is proud to present Extreme Survival Weekends. Hosted by the famous reality TV celebrity Grilled Bear. <laughs> bear Grills. Grilled Bear. Hell yeah. Uh, learn how to eat uncooked animals in varying states of decay. 
Experience how it feels to be covered in leeches and in your own fecal matter. Burn anything that you can get your hand greasy little paws onto. Register now. Space is limited. Only 30 minutes from Gothenburg. Uh, okay. All right. All right. Well, that's pretty intimidating. Now you definitely see. All right. Definitely see why they would think a horned devil was here. Okay. So we've kind of, oh, all right, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we've kind of circled this whole area. I don't see anything of any real worth. I'm excited that we got a new gun to pick up. This cause... is a mistake. We should back off. Okay. Let's go around the other way. Yeah, let's go around this way since we've already taken out this. Oh, what the hell? It says that there's an enemy. What? It says that there is an enemy right there. That's fascinating. Okay. Alright. So we'll take it the back way in and we'll see. What's hiding back here? Oh, I see some purples. Okay. All right, where's this Marauder gonna end up? Okay. Let's move Borman on up. Uh, Split up. Careful. They're all over the place, and we can't find them all at once. Let's take a look at this, because we've got a level up for him. Permanently increased health by one? Hell yeah. Borman just needs to have as much health as I can throw on him, and then he's doing his job as needed. Smoke some minutes from you when you take damage, that's pretty cool. Um, we've still only got 10 points. Magnus has got 7 points. Oh, he did take 1 point of damage from that fight. That's fine. I mean, it's not really fine, but whatever at this point you know all right let's although I'm pretty well kind of stuck in this situation but let's save it here Don't all right so somebody heard us and we heard you, yep. Nighty night. Let's ignore that. Let's Aim the bar. No sweat on it. Overwatch. Yeah, okay. See so we've got a marauder. Really, there doesn't seem to be that many people. Let's move four men into position here. Let's throw them into Overwatch. Let's reload. Overwatch. Overwatch. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. Oh yeah, ducks. And ducks, that's why we pay you the big bucks. Oh, ah, ha, ha, ha. no. Ooh, pyro, 25% chance to hit. New line of fire. All right, uh, let's hit you to overwatch. All right, well, let's activate you. Let's have you sneak. Um, 
let's mind control this guy. So for some reason he's not been activated. Pyro hasn't been activated and the tank hasn't been activated. So let's not activate them. This Marauder has been for some reason. Let's reload. Let's set to overwatch. Okay, no, everyone has been activated, okay. Dang it. Attack the target. I got you. Um, I got you. Okay. That pyro's gonna be a problem. Just run this hunter at some other hunters. Okay. Um. The tank's gonna be a, an ongoing issue that I'm just gonna have to try and deal with. Okay. What is he right now? He's a 50%. So it's worth me moving over here. There we go. I did that. What do you think about that, huh? Okay. Not too shabby. There we go. God, that guy's weapon is out of control, and I want it. I fucking want that weapon. Okay, so he's. It's a load of complete. Target DNA CFS loaded. Neutralize all mutant intruders. You missed? Come on, Marauder. I'm actually not all that scared by this thing. I say now. All right, let me see here. If I run over here, he I'm gonna be out in the open anywhere I go. Hunter's got 25% chance to hit. Let's just roll the dice, baby. Because I, I need to get Gorman back up. I really need to get. Okay, let's reload ducks. All 
right, let's shift ducks a little bit. 25% chance to hit, out of line of fire. Don't think, yeah, he's not on our team anymore. This can destroy cover, or rather it does destroy cover. Okay. Good stock. Okay, not too bad. The ugly one is the target. Okay, boss. Die. Oh my Where god, that there? tank. Okay. Yeah, okay. Here. Let me tend to your way. Get Borman up. Thank you. Overwatch. Set Borman to Overwatch. That's all the best I can get is a 25% chance to hit. Oh, but if I move over here, he's just gonna get ripped to shreds. Borman's just gonna get ripped to shreds. Move Borman over here. Come on, crit, baby. Oh, he's got fire damage. He's going down next turn. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Let's move over here with ducks. Ducks, you have but one function up here, and that is to make sure this thing never takes a turn. Now it's getting fun. Okay, we're good. We're good. Mm. Uh-oh. Okay, I took the damage. Oh, what the... Okay. Take 
Shit. Oh yes! Yes! Okay, okay. That's what I wanted. That's what I wanted. Contribute to the team. talking about the yeah, overwatch my my boot my booty hole okay oh Magnus is in some trouble okay The tank serves you right. Okay. Smash the feather one. Overwatch. Time to stop with him, stalker. The issue is that if I move out of cover. So we got one more heal.
Mind Control. Hunter. Fuck. Kill the freak! He did not kill Borman. There should be something. Biological in nature here to eat. Okay. Put ducks right back on up here. Yeah, Magnus, I'm sorry, man. One of the ducks is down. As good as dead. Get. Serves you right. You did it, kid. Essentially, just you wasted that ability because I reloaded first. Overwatch. One hit. Damn. Does that hurt? Okay. Okay, that's good. Newton down. There's nothing I can do uh, to get Borman or uh... Yeah, okay. Okay. holds nothing. Alright, load latest. Oh, not getting that mind trick there with the middle guy. That really kind of flubbed us over. Hmm, how can we... Here, let's do this. Let's ambush. Let's ignore Borman. Let's activate ducks. That was simply because Borman was just too gosh darn close. Okay, let's hide Borman here. Let's bring ducks up.
There's a Marauder over here. With 18 health. Let's do, let's do one of two things real fast. Let's save this. That's another one gone, another one gone, another one bites the dust. Okay. Okay. A molly. Yeah, yeah, prize time. Let's see what's in the box. Hmm. All right. Four extra movement range. Okay, so then we have hunter, hunter, chieftain, another hunter, and the tank. That's still a lot of people. The tank is huge. Oh. Oh. Nothing like a giant machine sleeping in a barn to make you lose all sense of reality. How interesting. <gasps> Hell yes. Oh, hell yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's save this game. Oh, hey, there's scrap up there. Okay, so my goal, my mission in life right now is to have, I don't, I don't necessarily want to move all of my mutants into that tower. Because if it goes horribly wrong and it does indeed attack everything then I don't want it to get my boys you know what I'm saying you said the generator would bring this giant to life did you lie to me no no lie okay
Let's activate him. He has 75% chance. Please work, please work, please work, please work. Yes, okay. Eat a dick. All humanoids must be eliminated. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, I totally forgot about the pyro in the tower. Eeks. I forgot about the pyro in the tower. Okay, let's ignore. Uh, let's... Let's sneak away. And then let's hide. There we go. Keep them fighting themselves. Ignore. Come on. Uh oh. Ducks should be allowed to be up there. <laughs> oh, shit. My boy. Get the hell out of there, ducks. Everyone. 
I can't help but think that... <laughs> Shit! Magnus, why are you running through this way? <sighs> My AI pathfinding is awful. Get ducks back in this fight, baby. Let's do this. Okay. Not too shabby. that I feel like with this thing on my side. Oh! I feel like this AI on this Z600 isn't as good as when the enemies got it, but when I've got it, it's just like I'm gonna just walk around and do nothing. I mean, I gotta give it to the pyro. He's giving it all that he's got. I don't wanna attack him. Sorry about there we that. go. Great work. Again, don't want to attack. Hmm. No line of sight. No line of sight. Okay. What is this? What is this action economy? What is? What? What are you doing? Why are you doing that? Why did you do it like that? Fifty-fifty <sighs> shot, baby.
Let's just move right here. Bye bye, tank. Piece of shit. Nice. Bye bye, gray one. They dropped one of us. Okay. Come on, no, 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 no. So we're gonna run over here. We're gonna kill you. Everybody wave goodbye to him. Bye. You do not have Overwatch. 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 Bleeds out in one turn. I'm gonna try to get over to you. Overwatch. This might sting a little. There we go. Appreciate it. Got Magnus back. Die. Miss, but. He has no cover. Let's get Magnus upstairs. Does mind controlling help me in this scenario? I don't want any of my guys to take damage. Okay, let's let's try sneak instead. How come I can't like Get Magnus over here. Let's move Borman over here. Overwatch. Come out, come out wherever you are. Oh, you piece of shit. Now it's getting fun. Uh, okay. Bye bye. Gotcha. They had it coming. And that is. Get over here. How we do it? All this talk about the horned devil and we never saw him, except for that sign. What a pussy. Show yourself, devil. The horned devil is probably dying with the angels. Would have liked to see him. That he put up a good fight. 
L generator, a dodo do dodecahedron shaped device that hums with elect electrical energy. It has potential to power an entire settlement. The marker read L generator chronicler Bowden. Yeah, look at this. A buzz humming, piston charging, fully operational power machine. <laughs> Prip would love this. Okay. Not a bad second go at it, if I don't say so myself. Not a bad second go at it. Getting in there, changing, hacking the machine. Oh. I don't know how you would do that normally. If, like... I mean, again, I could be using quiet stealth weapons, but like stealth weapons just have a huge damage drop off. They don't really add much damage, and so. Something good. Oh, what is this? Three armor, four health. Oh, ghoul armor. Okay. Not. Um, I mean, not not mind-blowingly good, but, I mean, it's pretty decent. Okay. Let's get some more scrap back here. Man, we got 108 scrap on this run. Let's see here. So this is the main entrance. Ooh. Can I? Yeah. Okay. Just had to believe. You've just got to believe. All right. I think that's so. That's everything up here from the horned horned devil layer. So let's head back to the ark. We'll scrap the gun I got. Um, I don't think we have any weapons that we need to upgrade. Welcome to the fix pit. My name's Delta. Let's dismantle this. Oh wow! No wait, I have a hundred and twenty-three weapon parts. One hundred and twenty-five weapon parts. Okay. All right, that looks cool. That looks cool. All right, everything is level three now, baby. Take it right. easy. Anchors, fix it. Oh wow, I got five. Okay, cool. Have a seat. Mutants get a discount. Okay, let's grab increased weapon damage by one. <sighs> Increase additional 10% crit chance against mechanical, 10% or increased grenade damage by four. I feel like we want to do increased grenade damage by four. My thought being this is situational towards robots, this is situational towards living beings living creatures this is for both creatures and living beings so i think we do that okay Excelente. all right let's head back to the castle of light All right. Are these guys going to be hostile to me now? I'm getting a a weird vibe from this place now.
Okay. No, okay, they're still here. Okay, good. So I guess this is when we're supposed to do the City of Lights quest. Is when we come through here and it's like, hey. Well, there's some common scrap I missed. Alright. Let's find out what this is all about down here. Oh, that's right. This is the Forbidden City. Graveyard of the Ancients. Okay. Uh, Alright. Let's see. Magnus has got ten... Uh, let's use med pack on you. Let's use med pack on you. Leaves us with one med pack. Man, and just to think, we started this. Started this out so well. I guess it is nice, three armor and four health, but I feel like being immune to electrical damage is nice. Is this? Three. See, look at this. Three armor, six health, and it does stuff. This is just three armor, four health, and it does nothing. Three armor, six health again. Yeah, I mean, I almost rather them just not give me the armor. You know, just don't give me anything. If you're gonna give me, if you're gonna give me garbage, don't give me anything. Okay, what have we got? We're doing the classic video game rules where if. We're able to go back from behind where we spawned. There's probably something there. That's the biggest wall I've ever seen. It's surrounding the entire city. They were trying to keep people out? No. They were trying to keep people in. The Red Plague started in this city. It spread fast, got out of control. So the powers that be built a wall around the city to quarantine it. To stop the people inside from infecting the world. Doomed them all. That was a long time ago. People are still scared to go in. That's why they call it the Forbidden City. So the plague might still be in there. Can you tell me again why we're going this way? Hammond said the Nova Sect were moving around the city. We cut through the city. We get to Eden first. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I do like how the characters kind of I don't want to say really organically, but I mean, for lack of a better term, organically kind of review. All right. After our hard work has finally started to bear fruit, Central Command has cut our project. Effective immediately, those ignorant cretins are afraid of what wonders we have accomplished. Under the cover of night, I gathered the surviving young and we made our escape into the zone. We are heading to an abandoned facility, which remains unmanned since the war. I shall not let my magnum opus be destroyed by those fools. Yep. Yep. That, it's definitely... Plot twist. The Elder is the big bad. Spread out. Hey, this machine's like the one we saw in Hammond's cabin, right? I can't hide against that wall, but I can hide against this table. Game. Game, game, game. 
Oh wait, wait, it's this. Oh. All right, I'm just gonna have to remember to switch that back. Well, this seems like we're about to fight non-organic beings in here. This is gonna be hard. I think this is gonna be very difficult. I mean, which follows, I mean, it tracks. This is the second, second to last area in the game. Although I think part of me was secretly hoping that this would just I hate cities. Always full of rotting corpses. Definitely thought he said something different. And I was like, ooh. Uh, that was a uh... Yeah, let's grab some more scrap. So, so far, we've just run into two, two robots, and there's a third robot. Oh, there's a big guy. There's a big guy. Okay. All right. So, right now, we're at a total of four robots. Level 60, that's pretty scary. Our road has come to an end. We need another way around. Another robot. Right. I'm trying to figure out what's the best way. go back and buy another health kit. I have received enough scrap to go back and buy another health kit. journey is just beginning start a new life off world mirror is offering a place places in our luxurious orbital facility for science we offer unlimited research possibilities for the brave we offer we can provide off-world military training outside of earthbound moral morality regulations for the fertile we can provide with the most advanced pre and postnatal care using the tool Tools provided in this kit submit the following to be considered for a perfect life beyond uh, the stars. DNA swab, sperm slash egg sample, blood sample, accreditation slash certificates, social media login details. Oh, they want to get you in on social medias? Nah, this is a scam. This is a Nigerian prince looking for your money. Um, we are looking forward to shaping a brighter future together. Remember industry. Okay. 
See these burn marks? Someone gave this thing quite a shock. What I'm really hoping for is that we find like um starting to look real good right now, isn't it? Let's keep moving. Hmm. So, oh, hello there. Uh, Katarinja, hello, thank you, welcome, welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? And I'm sorry if I butchered your name. Let's see here. Uh, let's go to our inventory. Alright, so we are fighting. Um, oh, look at all these, look at all these lovely MP grenades. Everybody's getting EMP grenades. You get an EMP grenade. You get an EMP grenade. Everybody, EMP grenades. Yay. Okay. <sighs> How's everyone doing in chat? I hope everyone's doing well. Um, if first time chat, so... I don't know if you've seen any Mutant Year Zero. I've had a couple people stop by and tell me that they've never heard or seen anything about this game. So I'm curious as to see how wide, how widely known this game is. Okay. I'm good at this game? Oh, all right. Well, this is my first playthrough. So I'm just... Taking her slow and steady here. I, I mean, I've really enjoyed everything that I've played um, so far with it. Um, so hopefully we're getting... I think I'm getting pretty close to the end. This seems like this is the second to last area. Or this is the Forbidden City. And then after this we are on to the... Um, I guess off to Eden. Um, but right now we are trying to get through the Forbidden City. I'm just trying to figure out right now, I'm trying to figure out the best way that I can to engage these guys. Um, I have a lot of EMP things, so I've got a lot of ways to take down guys. Um, right now, as you can see, running Borman Ducks. And, um, oh my gosh, Magnus and Magnus. Um, if you have any advice, I'm always happy to hear advice. Uh, I also pond also ponder my existence quite a bit. So ho hopefully you find it fun and entertaining. Um, so I have an, an EMP grenade. Those three guys get pretty close together. Those Polaris bot enforcers get pretty close together. I don't know if they get close enough that I can EMP them all together. But if I can EMP... If I can EMP them down there, we can have... Ducks try to take out and deactivate the Myanmar uh, Z600. Um, 
I do this silently? How do you do it silently? Uh, like all my... But looks like you like Rambo. Rambo? Yeah. I... Uh, go on with Rambo. <laughs> I... So I took the first part of the game real silently. And... Like, the weapons just, like, ch maxed out at, like, six or seven. And I was like, I don't get how we're getting to a point where there's just armor. And I was like, I, I don't I don't know. I mean, I guess there's also, the flip side of the coin is, you don't have to fight everything. I could just try and sneak past these guys. But, I don't know. I find it a little more fun to, to fight head on. Um, so... Before I before I engage, let's go ahead and hit save. That way, when I inevitably when I die, we're we're here in this configuration. Okay, um, I have enough scrap. I can go back and get some more first aid kits, which will probably be needed. Um, let's send Borman and Magnus down to ground level, and we're gonna have them group E and P the robots that are down here. And then we will, uh, let's see, a charge absorber, yeah, 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 this should be, should be fine. None of these are reprogrammable things, right? Okay, I don't see anything that says it's reprogrammable. So since you play this, um, who all do you normally run in your group? If you play on the hardest difficulty, silent may be the only way. Yeah. Yeah, I, I'm not playing on the hardest difficulty. I'm playing on the second highest because... I figure I'll play through it once on like the normal difficulty um, uh, just to get an understanding of how combat and encounters work um, and then kind of understand like how sparse resources are. So I'm just checking this out. Okay, I want you to hide here. Okay, so one EMP grenade can get both of the Polo Spot, Polo Spot Enforcer, and then we can throw another EMP grenade and get that other Polo Spot Enforcer, deactivating them for a couple of rounds. Then we're going to have Ducks snipe the Mimar 7600, Z600, and get that to be stunned. Hopefully deactivate it. I have the ability on him to shut down tech. Hold on. I have that on someone else too. Pharaoh. Pharaoh also has it. Is it worth switching out Magnus for Pharaoh? Let's see this. Wand. Switch over to Pharaoh. Inventory. Weapon. Let's get you a EMP grenade. Okay. Three, six. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, immune to critical hits. Immune to electrical. Immune to. Mm, immune to electrical. Let's do an immune to electrical. Uh, mutations. We got 12 points here. Um, reach high places by simply moving or sprinting in combat. More health. More health is always nice. Leapfrog ability. Jump to any location within range. Oh, what does this do? Permanently increases crit... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's take the permanently increases crit chance. 
for sure. For sure we're gonna do that. Okay. Um, let's see here. Borman can't eat anything in this combat. Um, and it looks like a lot of things are immune to this. So let's switch him over to... Alright. Uh, fire two using only one AP. Minus 25% accurate. Hmm. Let's try it out. Let's try it out. What the hell? You only live once, right? I want her to have that. Uh, let's throw the wings on. Okay. Uh, what is this? Doubles crit chance while whilst shooting whilst hidden. Okay. Yep. Yep. So right now we're rocking. Ducks is a hundred percent crit chance. A hundred percent. Um. Oh! Man, that is... Okay. That is that is absolutely maddening. That has happened so many times during my run, where it's just like, I'll switch over to another character, see what's happening there with them, and then they're just immediately stand up out of cover, and they're and just like, get him! No! It's not what I wanted to happen. Okay. Activate. Throw grenade. EMP grenade. Oh. Okay, so this EMP grenade should knock out both of those guys. Activate. EMP grenade. Should deactivate that guy. Alright, so we got three turns. Does that hurt? Deactivated him for two. Stacked another one on him. I'm the hero, you're the zero. Hell yeah. yes! Okay. Let's see if I move here. Crit, baby, crit. Yes. Yeah, I love the crits. Okay. Seventy-five percent chance. It's 
take that. Okay. Put that thing down for good. Let's Overwatch. throw you into Overwatch. Maybe hit both times. Yes. Okay. Come on. Don't think that should have worked, but it worked. I have no idea why the other robots did not hear. Oh. I have been hunting for this thing the entire goddamn campaign. I have wanted a giant fuck off gun. Hell yeah, big boy gun. I am so goddamn excited for that. All right, I'm glad that it gave it to me right here at the bitter end, but we good, we good. All right. Let's see. There is a. All right. So where from where Dux is up there, Dux has a hundred percent chance of hitting this Mymar, Mymir, Mymir, Mymir. Eleven parts twenty. Okay. Okay. And we're gonna take out this guy. Now, if I remember correctly, this should be a safe enough distance away from this damn thing that we shouldn't get hit. Oh, he can't activate. Okay, okay. Let's ambush, baby. Yeah, Pharaoh, nice job. Crit hit, baby. Okay. 100% chance to hit. Okay. Yeah, I did. Yes. You think about that, huh? Okay. Okay. Reload. Hell yes. Okay. Oh, God, that feels so good. Oh, combat in this game just feels so satisfying. Ingrid has new weapons at the item. Yeah, yeah, yeah. New, new items at the uh, weapon shop. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So I have two more, two more robots to take out. Man, this is a lean meat robot killing machine team I've got right here. And boy howdy, I'd love to say that 19 times fast. Oh my gosh, let, let me just let me just gaze upon it. Oh. Oh. It's a beaut. It's a beaut carlock. Okay, so I'm scrapping this. How do I get this up to level three as fast as I possibly can? So it's 30 to get it to level two, 40 to give it to level... 30 to get it to level two, and then 60 to get it to level three. So it's 90. I don't think I'm gonna get 90 scrap from this. Oh, this was an utter surprise. Utter surprise. 
I'm actually curious. Okay, so at its base, it is not as good as the boomstick. Well, it's very comparable to the boomstick, but the boomstick's also maxed out. Okay. Yeah. Hell yeah. I definitely feel like the doom music just kicked in once I got that gun. All right, we got 15 points. We're almost there. I don't know if you have any thoughts on this, but I guess you become invisible until you attack is nice. But the way I'm running ducks, the wing setup that gets me that 100% crit chance to get that higher elevation, I think I'm just waiting to get the in increase by one. These two are nice, but with the weapon range that I have him with in the back row, allowing him to snipe and then having him shut off machines is great. And I keep forgetting that I have the knee shot. I need to switch that up when I fight against organics. Throw the knee shot on him.